Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. First of all, before I get into this video, um, good news, my Microsoft Edge Canary browsers are up and running again, and they were on the blink for almost two weeks where um, I had a black screen instead of what you are seeing now. And finally today, with my overnight update to um, Edge Canary, as you can see, everything is up and running, and I'm actually very happy about this because I've been out of action with my Canary Edge browsers now for, as mentioned, at least two weeks. Now, I'm um, moving straight into the video now. Um, I posted a video previously at the end of April um, that in Edge Canary version 114, there was a new option called Detach from Edge that allows you to separate the side panel from the main Edge window and attach it to your desktop. So just to demonstrate, and I'll leave a link to that video down below because it will give you a whole lot more uh, information. But just to do a quick recap, as you can see if in the sidebar, if we click on Detach from Edge, uh, we can actually detach the browser from the actual sidebar. And even if I close or minimize Edge, that sidebar now basically stays as a desktop sidebar widget, so to speak. And you can access all your productivity tools and your new big chat and your tools and your email or whatever you have when it comes to the actual productivity tools and quick action buttons you have posted and pinned to the actual sidebar. You can access that from the convenience of your desktop. Now, just a quick update video um, to let you know that um, actually last month in May, um, according to a recent um, Microsoft 365 um, roadmap update, um, the option to attach Edge sidebar to the Windows desktop is going to be rolling out soon. And this was updated um, on the 23rd of May. That was last month. But as mentioned, my Edge Canary browser has been... Um, on the blink for at least two weeks or so so um wasn't been wasn't able to post that video but now i can let you know because i can actually demonstrate once again that soon in the stable version the same option will be rolling out and microsoft is saying um in the microsoft 365 uh, roadmap that and i'm quoting this users of the microsoft edge sidebar will soon have the option to access their apps and sites directly from their Windows desktop. So basically that's using, as mentioned, the sidebar now, which can be pinned uh, to the desktop. And that rollout is starting this month. So we are already on the 6th of June in my region today. So we can expect that rollout any day now coming to the stable version because this option currently is not available in the stable version. But according to that 365 roadmap update, um, the option to attach the Edge sidebar to the Windows desktop should be rolling out um, throughout the course of June. And I think that would be with a a update that will roll out because Microsoft does push out a couple of maintenance updates between version upgrades. So I think that we could be getting that um, sooner than later. And obviously when that and when this feature does become available in the actual um, stable version, I will post and let you guys know. And just a quick recap, if you want to reattach everything, you just head down to the three dotted menu, click on that, and there we go, close and reattach to Edge. And there we go, everything is back to normal and the browser functions and the sidebar has been removed from the desktop and has once again been attached to the Edge web browser. And this is currently in Edge Canary. And as mentioned, throughout the course of this month, June, we should be getting the same option rolling out to the stable version. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.